Well, it's the 28th of July. And as you can see here, we've had a major setback. I uh, got home from work and I was going to do a little uh, plastic carving and then I noticed this. And uh, the plastic behind it, I don't know if you can see it. I'll, I'll come up with a close-up here in a minute. Uh, this has pushed back, but the plastic is still so holding. Now, what I've got to do is I'm going to take this out and uh, try and figure out what happened. Why did it collapse? Because there's something about the way I put the dirt behind it. Maybe I got it too wet or did something with it. Uh, and I've got to correct that because see, there's nothing else showing any signs that uh, there's something wrong. And uh, this wall right here has got a lot of dirt behind it, just about as much as that, maybe even more. And the only other wall that has any sign at all is this one, because this little piece here is bowing out a little bit. But I uh, attribute that to the fact that there's a joint here. So, uh, see there's a joint there, so maybe there's a problem there too. Maybe my theory isn't going to work, but it should. But So what I've got to do is uh, stop, pull this section out, and uh, try to redo it. But as you can see there... Okay, let's see if we can start to unzip this wall. Move this out first. Well, let's do the top first, because the top is likely under very little pressure. So, let's see. Here. Here. There's nothing holding anything. I've taken all the screws out of the bottom between the bottom plate and 4x4, four four, and all these screws are out of here. And across that top plate, I've taken that seal plate off. So let's see if we can pop this out. Okay. and I don't know what it was. And I can hear, I can hear uh, dirt running behind something. You hear that creak, creak? It's over, oh, I see what it is. Pressure on that wall. I think that wall is going to give way. It just looks like it. So, at any rate, let's finish this.
Mm-hmm, I'll stay. 